Hey people, welcome back to the Becoming TV series, where we explore the deep truths and the principles that will enable you to become everything you are created to be, do, and have. This is your host, Willie Moana. So, so far, uh, the eight greatest needs of the human heart, we've talked about three of them. Purpose, value, and importance. Now, I'd like to take the next two together because I think um, they are interrelated, right? And these two are significance and meaning. Significance and meaning. Now, why are these two um, among the greatest needs of the human heart? It's because, number one, everybody wants to feel significant, right? Now, we talked about importance as a deep need, right? Now, if, if you're not significant or you don't think that you're significant, you really wouldn't be able to do much because you'll forever be looking at yourself through the lens of the wrong perspective, right? Now, everything that you're able to do really stems from the belief that you think you can do that thing, right? Because action or performance stems from a belief system, what you believe about yourself. If you believe that you're the kind of person who can walk on water, metaphorically speaking, you'll be able to do things that other people won't be able to necessarily do. If you believe that you have the capacity to do a great work, you will do it because you believe that about yourself. But if you don't, no matter what anybody else says, no matter how equipped you really are, if that belief system is not there, you really won't be able to do anything. And a lot of us are not manifesting ourselves, a lot of us are not becoming ourselves because despite the fact that we have the equipment, we don't have the right belief system. We don't feel that we are significant enough to achieve X, Y, Z. We don't think that we're significant enough to be a billionaire. We don't think that we're significant enough to attract this person into our life. Your sense of significance is very vital to your performance, it's very vital to your output, it's very vital to what you're able to achieve. Because for as long as you don't think you're, you're worth something, for as long as you, don't, as you don't think that you're significant enough to attract a resource, you really wouldn't push yourself to achieve it. Because your sense of significance has been downplayed. Which leads me to the next one, meaning. Now, why meaning? It's because if you look throughout human history, man has always um, wanted to understand the context for life. We've always wanted to explore the environment around us. We wanted to go to outer space. We wanted to go to inner space. We wanted to understand how, how things work. We want to understand the meaning of it all. That is why we have so many philosophers, so many explorers, so many people who, who want to push the envelope of what is possible. So many people who are not content with the status quo because we want to push the boundaries of what is possible. All the great um, explorers, all the great inventors, all the great scientists have always been consumed by the sense of meaning. And that is why, especially in the 21st century, we have seen an explosion of so many things because more and more people are tapping into this need, the need of meaning, right? And if you're going to push yourself to achieve, if you're going to push yourself to become, you must try and understand the meaning or the context for your life. Because for as long as context is not there, the real conversation won't occur. I hope this really helps you. I'll come your way next time. Peace.